The search for extraterrestrial life continues. According to new research from a team at the University of Warwick, one of the Kepler mission's most Earth-like candidates would be utterly uninhabitable to carbon-based life. The Kepler mission is searching for planets that are enough like Earth to be considered habitable. Discovered in January 2015, Kepler 438b looked like an excellent candidate. The planet fit the two key characteristics for a Kepler candidate to AT. The first of these is that the planet has to be rocky, like Earth or Mars, rather than gaseous, like Jupiter or Saturn. The second is that it has to orbit its star in the habitable zone, where temperatures are neither too hot nor too cold to support life. Kepler 438b it is only 12% bigger than Earth and receives about 40% more light. Kepler 438b is similar in temperature to the Earth, but it is much closer to its star, a cooler red dwarf called Kepler 438. Kepler 438b orbits Kepler 438 every 35 days. The research team, led by David Armstrong of the university's astrophysics group, has discovered that the star is very active, shooting super flares and associated coronal mass ejections every few hundred days. Using photometry, the team detected excess radiation caused by the star's flares. The coronal mass ejections from the star, ten times more powerful than any on record made by our Sun, may have stripped the planet of its atmosphere. Life as we know it needs an atmosphere. Every life form on Earth depends on the atmosphere for respiration, but it goes beyond that. Earth's atmosphere also protects us from harmful radiation.